Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make your own oat milk at home that you can use for your hair and even just for your consumption. So let's get started. Okay, so in a bowl, I will pour in the oats. And if you're going to make this for consumption, pour in cold water. But since I want it to swell quick, I'm going to use hot water. So I'm just going to leave that in for about an hour there, cover it just so that the cooking process would be a lot quicker. And then after an hour, this is what it's going to look like. So now I'm going to put that in a blender and add in tap water. Now the proportion is totally up to you. I added about two to three cups of water in there and then finely blended everything, making sure that the oats are pureed or blended. And then I will use a soap cloth or you can also use a cheesecloth in order to filter out the fiber granule parts of the oats. And you will be left with just this pure and smooth oat milk. And you guys, please don't skip this process because you don't want those particles left on your hair because they're so hard to remove or wash out your hair if you don't strain it at all. Okay, so I'm just going to transfer it in a bottle container and then they are ready to use. And I will store in the leftover in the fridge okay so now this is what it looks like now oat milk is full of nutrients that are good for your hair and scalp it also contains vitamin B magnesium and folate this is also great to use if you are combating frizz and oat milk has moisturizing and nourishing qualities and it's actually a great leave-in conditioner it is also considered as a natural cleanser because it draws out excess oils in the scalp to restore shine and it has some anti-inflammatory properties to help relieve dandruff and other irritations without using any harsh chemicals. It can also improve the hair's elasticity and make the hair soft because it is rich in omega-6 fatty acids that can help repair damaged hair. Also, oatmeal contains polysaccharides which makes the hair soft. You guys, excuse the background, we're actually moving. So what I did right here is I transferred the oat milk in this um, bottle container right here just for easy application, but it would be best if you actually do this in the bathroom or in the sink to where you can really soak your hair with the oat milk. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. Okay, so I have a little basin right here to where I could just put all of my hair in and just so that the floor is not going to be messy. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and just do this. This is actually um, a really good applicator. So first, I'm applying this on my scalp, and this is actually good to use on the scalp if you are suffering with oily scalp. And I'm also not sure if you guys noticed, but there are actually a lot of hair products or skin products that contain oats. It's because oats have a lot of hair and skin benefits. So what I'm doing right now, I'm um, first concentrating it on my scalp. And then now I'm just going to be applying that all over my hair, <laughs> making it rain. Because oats, as I said, can make your hair soft and smooth. So I'm just doing that. I also still have some left in here, so I'm just gonna go ahead and pour that all over my hair. Since I have the base in here, I'm just gonna go ahead and soak my hair in it, right there. You can use this treatment just as like you would apply or you would soak in the rice water on your hair, but this time it's just using oats. And actually also oats promote um, healthy hair growth as well, so that's why it's good to put that on the scalp. Okay, so I'm gonna leave this on my hair for about an hour and then just wash it off with water. All right, you guys, so this is what my hair looks like right now. It's super soft and smooth, and my hair right now has a little bit of waves just because I was putting it on a braid and then in a bun a while ago. I also like how it made my scalp feel very soft and smooth. And it did get rid of the excess oils on my scalp, which is really great. So that's why my hair now looks bouncy and it doesn't look way down at all. So that's a really big bonus and a plus. And also in addition to that, oat milk made my hair very soft, smooth, and manageable. And furthermore, this is a good rinse to do on your scalp if your scalp is oily or if your hair is oily as well. And as I've said, it is a good gentle cleanser that does not make your hair dry at all. Plus, I'm sure anyone has oats around in their kitchen and it's very easy to make as well. So that is it, you guys. I hope you all like this video. And also let me know 
know in the comments down below if you have ever used oat milk on your hair and as I've said, you can also use this recipe or customize this recipe if you actually wanna, you know, take in or use oat milk. And actually before I have used oat rinse on my hair just to get rid of excess oils on my hair and oats are really great to use for both your hair and scalp if you're suffering from oily scalp and dry hair. And you can actually also use oats as a replacement to a dry shampoo. And once again, if you found this content valuable, please do share it to a friend and I'll see you on my next one. Bye.